Hey guys, I have a new um, book to show you guys today. This book is called Strictly Fantasy and it's by K.L. Manier. I hope I'm saying that's right. Manier. M O N N I E R. Otherwise known as Lady Willow 13. And um, she sent me this book for a really special reason, and I'm going to read part of this letter to you guys so you can understand um, why. It says, the reason I made these coloring books is because I lost a child three months ago, and they were to be the foundation for families who've lost children to SIDS, miscarriages, stillbirths, and or accidents, and it will help pay for their children's funerals. Thank you for showing the world that despite heartbreak, it will always there will always be beauty. So this touched me, and I really appreciate what she's doing and her cause. Um, so let me start showing you some of these pages. Um, this is her card. Don't worry, I'm going to post all of this at the end. This is where you can purchase it at her Etsy and at Redbubble. I'm going to put links down at the bottom. I just wanted to show you guys. Um, just for video purposes, I'm going to take it off, um, take it out, I'm sorry, of the cover. Make life a little easier while I'm flipping the pages. <clears throat> what I like about um, Etsy is you can print off your own as many times as you want. Uh, if you mess up, print it again. <laughs> I like that. So you can buy the whole entire book. Or you can purchase um, individual pages, whichever page you want. So, um, if you like one page more than the other, just go get the one that you like. So, I, I absolutely love how she um, how she draws. I think it's beautiful. She takes up the whole page. I love how she does the eyes. This is a really beautiful cover. I, I love the wings coming off of the fantasy word right here. This is really cool. Let me just flip it over here. This one, this Medusa is creepy cool. I love Medusa, y'all. Um, I'm gonna have. I was gonna do this one first, but another picture caught my eye, and I had to do that one. But I love the teeth, the fingernails. I love everything about this picture. And here we go. Um, I always call these um, the sirens, but I, I'm not sure. I think they have another name. These mermaids. I don't know but it is very very cool this is the one I did I just loved her hair I love the jellyfish I love the skull the coral just everything this is the first time I've ever done a mermaid where I didn't color the top of it like traditional colors and I colored the entire mermaid one solid color um, so I just really like how it came out there's a lot of glitter Posca pen and some um stickles on here and on the jellyfish and all in the background it's hard to see but it is so shiny and pretty i'm definitely going to hang this one up in my room okay here we go with another one i love how she does these flowers look at this corset this is awesome really really nice I love him. He reminds me of a page I did in another artist book, um, Mardell Rubio, I believe it was mascara. Really cool. I mean, she just went all out on the details of the hair and the braids and everything. Absolutely love this page. Oh, look at the little broken toenails and everything. I just noticed those. Wow, that is really, really neat. All right, here we go. Her face, I absolutely love these eyes. I mean, her drawing is just spot on perfect. And the hair we got going flowing down here, hair down here. These nails though, love them. I'm drawn to these eyes. Really, really cool. This one is exciting. I'm going to be coloring this sucker around Halloween. I just love stuff like this. Um, she just looks like she's going to be fun to color. Spooky. 
I know it's not, but this wood grain, I kept seeing, and I was looking at, I kept seeing eyeballs right here, y'all. <laughs> that would be so cool. Um, this is a very neat picture. I love it. Look at the crystals here, all the little details, the little broken egg. I wonder what came out of that. Uh, the little skulls, even the stand for her book is awesome. Right here we got like this snake charmer lady with these statues of these look like King Cobras back here and fire. She's charming this snake over here. She's got one over here too. And look at this big one twisting around here y'all. Crazy. She puts a lot of details into her work, and I really, really appreciate that. I love when artists fill up the whole page like this. It just gives you so much um, to work with. This one is beautiful. I love it. It's so cute. I love the details in these little flowers and the bees and everything. This is a really, really nice book. Look at the little fairy. I love it. Check out this cool dragon, y'all. The details is this head and the wings, how they wrap around, the claws on the feet. Really, really nice. This will be so beautiful colored in. Oh, look at the orc. Isn't he cool? My daughter has already claimed this picture. She said she's coloring it. So she does World of Warcraft. So I'm like, have fun. Go for it. <clears throat> I love the eye. She's got the dead eye. She's got a big old, like what I could tell is like a bloody, um, bloody slash in his head right here. He's got broken teeth. Look at this big broken one right here. I mean, who thinks of all this stuff? That is so crazy. The earrings. Looks like somebody ripped the earring out of this one. I love it. I know I keep saying that, but I'm really obsessed with this book. I want to color every page. She is beautiful. Look at the flowers. Her face. She looks like she's just a bride to me. I was calling her the bride. Again, with these eyes. They're just mesmerizing. I love how she does her eyes. Y'all know I love to do faces, so I'm going to enjoy doing um, coloring this one. <clears throat> There's another one with dragons. This time we've got two dragons, and they are battling it out right here. There's a big one right here. See the big head? And there's a little one. I can already see the colors and how I want to do this in my head. Amazing. And then we got this one. It looks to me like she is coming out of a, a volcano, like magma. This looks like magma to me, but um, I love these hibiscus flowers. I have these in my yard. They're just gorgeous. Look at her. She's got like a, a fire suit on and everything. Isn't that awesome? It's creepy cool. You know what I mean? I love stuff like this. These are great pages, y'all. I am excited about these. So, yes. Go check her out. I will post a link to all of the places you can find her. A quick flip back through all of them again. I had so much fun coloring this, guys. Look at all of the colors and shine. This was so fun. And then this one. He is amazing. What I like is she's got pictures for like guys. Guys love to color too. This is a great page for a guy. Bunch of these are. This one is amazing. I know my husband would color that orc one if my daughter hadn't stole it. <laughs> and the dragon. 
Oh yeah, this is such a wonderful book. And I love her cause. If you guys really want to go and check her out, um, just look at the bottom. I'll post all the links. If you have any questions or comments, let me know. And um, I really appreciate you guys watching. If you have not hit that sub button, please hit it. And the little bell next to it so you'll get all the notifications from me. And um, if you like this video, please hit that thumbs up and share it for me. I appreciate it. It helps me out a lot. Thank you guys. Bye-bye.